The following video is a little small sampling of the videos you will see during this convention. Hey everyone, guess who just walked in? Olivia. Today's poll, would she ever? No, she would never, she's an angel. <laughs> I wanted to go up to the girls and smash their phones. Neutral, ain't no neutral. You're just a coward. Take your trash. What I was feeling back then was just sadness. Never really peace. Hello everyone, Haley from Junior Design here. Is there just a little bit of envy in there? In June of 2018, a huge group of armed men came to us. They represented the ideals of my childhood. Do you have any idea what this is gonna cost us? I didn't have a choice, you went behind my back. Where's your mask? Do you know how many people have actually gotten sick? Zero. That's what always happens when you're just about to lose all your strength. Jehovah does that something for you. I'm so grateful that we made peace before the world turned upside down. Isn't the world already turned upside down if you're one of Jehovah's Witnesses? Don't you already view this world as doomed, as in the grips of Satan? What an odd teaser. Or as Stephen Lett puts it, little small sampling of the convention dramatizations that we can look forward to. I found it very dark and sinister and morbid. You know, if this were a video that I was making and I was maybe directing Tibor, who's our video editor, that's the sort of music selection that would come about as a result of me saying to Tibor something like, can you make the music really dark and intense and scary? It's a conscious decision they've made to ramp up the drama, to ramp up the, the feeling of urgency. And it's manipulative. It's intended to frighten Jehovah's Witnesses, to frighten the people who are attending this convention. And isn't that how cult indoctrination works? If you think about it, this is how all cultish leaders get a following. It's by playing on people's fears, by making a bogeyman under the bed that people should be afraid of and simultaneously presenting themselves as the remedy, presenting themselves as the vanquisher of the bogeyman. It's a classic manipulation tactic that gets used time and time again, not just in religion, but in politics. For me, this small sampling or tiny sampling is a sampling of fear. It's a sampling that demonstrates that ultimately Jehovah's Witness propaganda is all about scaring people into following the governing body and recognizing their power and authority.